7 p.m. I'm trying to sneak past the top side of Manila traffic. Wait, I'm not sure how that's going to work out. We've only been back for two weeks. I cannot remember how this all works out. Everybody's been saying Manila traffic's been getting worse and worse. Anyways, I'm going to Tondo. I'm going to hang out with the Christian community there. A bunch of guys call themselves Theo Sacanto. Got on the street. I haven't seen him for four months. So come with me to Tondo. <laughs> This is rush hour every single day, and I came out at the wrong time. You can see that whoever spent their money on those billboards is definitely getting their money's worth. So I made it all the way here. I'm at Divisoria. The biggest market in Manila where all the stuff comes in from China and gets sold to the people who are going to sell it over to the Philippines. And Jeff lives about five blocks from here. So I'm just about at Jeff's place and then I'll see my boys I haven't seen for a long time. That's David story right behind me. That's a lot of tricycle drivers. I'm here with Teo Sacanto. Some of Teo Sacanto. And we're doing or having Tagay. Paano sa Tagalog? How do you say it? Tagay muna. So Tagay is like cheers for Filipinos. But when you have Tagay, when you sit around and you drink a cold, refreshing beverage, you have. So you have one cup, you have one big beverage like this. It's like a toast. And then the tanguero is the guy who's in charge of the whole thing. And so he pours a cup. Oh, as you see, he'll pour the cup. Step one. Step one. And he'll pass the cup. Oh, step Tagay. two. Tagay. Tagay. Then you drink the cup. <laughs> if it's finished, with... okay, I'll just chug it. <laughs> you, 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 you forgot that. You forget that. No, Pulu the Pulu Titan. Pulu Titan. Okay, well, I'll tell, I'll tell about Pulu Titan first. Okay. So when you finish the cup, you give it back to Tanguero. Tanguero. Then he pours the cup again, and then he passes it to the next person. We're not thinking about germs here. We're symbolizing community. Yeah. yeah this is in, in Filipino society, this symbolizes community and togetherness and brotherhood. One heart, one mouth. One heart. <laughs> one heart, one mouth. <laughs> now, puluten, what Fred was saying, is the side stuff that goes with the tagay. With this time it's fruit that Taki that brought from far, one far of away. The Santol. Santo, Santol. 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 This is Blick. <laughs> this is Taki. This is Fred. This is Jeff. And these are some of Teo Sacanto. Bye! Those guys are awesome. They're really thinking about how they spend their time, how they can best serve their community, making sure their community isn't being taken advantage of. They're, you know, surrounded by urban poor and they want to make sure that they can give dignity to their neighbors because a lot of people want to come to Tondo. So Tondo, the area I was in, is known for having a garbage dump that people have lived off of and for years, lots and lots of people. And there's a lot of poverty there and there's a lot of non-government organizations and church organizations there and the systematic injustice, the systemic pain still exists. Listen to them process how they can serve in their own community and take care of their neighbors and be a church that's really rooted deeply in their own neighborhood, as well as um, decide how much space they want to give for other people coming in because they don't want to just 
abuse their neighbors by showing foreigners and outsiders around. They want to be open to learn, to teaching people and showing people the story, but they don't want to uh, exploit the community. I mean, those guys are so wise. They've learned a lot in their lives, and they've taught me so much. And I'm so thankful to know them. Yeah.